Hi, welcome back to Learn Me Some English's Daily News Podcast 27. My name is Jean Meesom, and you can find me at www.learnmesomeenglish.com. And today's article is Finland Tests World's First Digital Passport. This article is courtesy of engoo.com, where you can find many different articles, which all include the English vocabulary and comprehension questions. So today we're going to start with the vocabulary. I'll give you the definition and an example sentence. I would like you to stop and try to make a sentence of your own when you can. Okay, now let's begin with the vocabulary word. One, physical as an adjective, relating to or involving things that can be seen, touched, etc. Despite the growing popularity of online shopping, many buyers still prefer shopping in a physical store. Two, credential, noun, a document showing someone's identity or qualifications. Can I see your credentials, please? Three, smooth, adjective, having no problems or difficulties. The project got off to a smooth start. Four, risk, verb, to expose someone or something to danger, harm, etc., to act in a way that brings about the possibility of something unpleasant. The firefighter risked his life to save the little girl. Five, complicated, adjective, complex or difficult. Some of the complicated diagrams in this book are more confusing than helpful. Six, register, to enter into or record on an official list. In 1977, the unique shape of a Coca-Cola bottle became a registered trademark in the U.S. Okay, now let's begin with the article. Finland tests world's first digital passport. Finland has been called the happiest country in the world, partly thanks to its great health care, free university, and clean air and water. And now there's something else to make Finns smile. It has become the first country in the world to allow travelers to enter with a digital passport on their phone instead of a physical passport. Called Digital Travel Credentials, or DTC, the digital passport is only a test for now. The program started on August 28th and will run until the end of February 2024. It's only available to Finnish citizens arriving at Helsinki Airport and only on Finnair flights from three British cities, London, Edinburgh, and Manchester. The Finnish Border Guard says the digital passport will allow for smooth and fast border crossings without risking security. However, getting a digital passport is a little complicated. Finnish citizens must first download the Finn DCC pilot app on their phone. They must then make an appointment to register with the police either at Helsinki Airport or at Vanta Main Police Station's License Services Center. When they register, citizens need to bring their physical passport and have their photo taken. But they will only need to do this once, after which they can use the digital passport as often as they like. Finland's digital passport test is being supported with $2.5 million from the European Union, EU. The EU is also planning other digital passport tests in the Netherlands and Croatia and says it wants at least 80% of its citizens using digital ID by 2030. Okay, now let's begin with the comprehension questions. One, who can use Finland's digital passport? Answer, it's only available to Finnish citizens arriving at Helsinki Airport and only on Finnair flights from three British cities. Two, is the process for getting a digital passport simple? Answer, no. However, getting a digital passport is a little more complicated. Three, what other countries does the EU plan to test digital passports in? Answer, the EU is also planning on digital passport tests in the Netherlands and Croatia. And four, what are your thoughts on Finland testing a digital passport? Five, do you think all personal documents will be digital in the future? Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed today's article. Again, my name is Jean Meesom, and you can find me at www.learnmeasomenglish.com. I hope you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.